We're here with Sonos checking out their first ever wireless headphones, the Sonos Ace. So Sonos is a well-known brand in terms of home audio. They've got amazing sound bars and other speakers, but this is the first time that they're coming out with a pair of headphones. So like other premium headphones in this space, these are excellently designed. They've got a wonderful, almost a minimalist design. You can see the single like piece of stainless steel goes right in and out like that. So there's no place for hair to get caught on, for example. We've got controls, physical controls, I should say, on both ear cups so that they're easy to find just by your touch. And if you take a look here, they're gonna be available in two colors, white and black. I actually kind of prefer the white ones just because of these metal accents. It really kind of stands out, I think. So the Ace have a few tactile buttons on the side. This one here is a multifunction button that increases and decreases the volume, lets you play and pause tracks, and you can also use it to connect to your Sonos soundbar. Right below it is a button to turn on and off the active noise cancellation. On the other ear cup at the bottom here is just a simple power button, and that's it. So at 11 ounces, these are fairly light headphones for the size, but more importantly, they're really comfortable too. When you're wearing them, they're very comfortable. That's because they've got a lot of really good padding here. This is vegan leather and the weight is distributed evenly and the pressure is distributed evenly so that there's no one hard point against your skull. They also cut a really thin profile too. You can even take off the cups here, which are magnetic and you can see you know, just how thin they are so they're not gonna take up a lot of space in your bag. Inside each cup is a 40 millimeter driver, which in our brief demo delivered amazing sound. In addition, there's also spatial audio and some other features in here that really deliver an immersive soundscape. Another neat feature with these headphones is that they have head tracking technology. So when it's paired with your TV, the sound will always appear to be coming from in front of you, even if you turn your head to the left or the right. It's a really neat effect. You can also listen to lossless audio in these headphones in two methods. One is if you connect it uh, using the port on the bottom, or if you have a Android phone with a compatible Snapdragon audio processor, you can get it over Bluetooth. Of course, no set of headphones is any good if it runs out of power. Fortunately, the Sonos Ace has up to 30 hours of battery life. Even better is a fast charging capability. So if you plug them in for just three minutes, you'll get three hours of battery life. One of the key features of the Sonos Ace is that you can pair it with a Sonos Arc soundbar. So if you're listening or watching a movie at home and you don't want to disturb anybody, you can simply press a button on here and have the audio transferred from your soundbar right into the speakers. Even better, the listening experience you get within the headphones is gonna be nearly identical to what you get with the soundbar. That's because it uses room mapping to deliver a similar audio profile from the soundbar inside the speakers. So while you're listening inside the headphones, it's gonna sound like you're in the room with everything where it should be. Sonos calls the feature True Cinema. True Cinema works similarly to Sonos's other audio mapping capabilities. In this case though, the sound bar will send out signals and the microphones within the headphones itself will pick up those audio cues and then create a room profile based on that. The Sonos Ace will be available on June 5th for 449. That places them in between the Bose QuietComfort Ultra and the Apple AirPods Max. Like Sonos' other products, the Sonos Ace command a premium price, but you're getting premium audio quality at the same time. As someone who's used other Sonos products in the past and have been very pleased with them, I'm very curious to see how these headphones will perform. Let us know if you're excited about the Sonos Ace. Drop us a line in the comments below. You can also follow Tom's Guide on all the socials at Tom's Guide. Keep a lookout for our full review of the Sonos Ace, which should be coming fairly soon. Until then, I'm Mike Prospero for Tom's Guide.